what role has, has Three Horizons and Strategy in Action played for you in recent years and, and how have you used the Strategy in Action offering? Well, I first came across Three Horizons when I was head of strategy for GKN and we actually started off looking at capital allocation, but then I realized that the strategy and action process was much more powerful than that. Uh, and I was asked to create a, an additive manufacturing business for GKN. And that was the first time that I worked with Three Horizons to run the full strategy process for that business and create a strategy and action plan for the additive manufacturing business. And that was when I realized how powerful this could be. Uh, and I then took that idea into Ultra Electronics. And in Ultra, we've used it now for almost all of our portfolio businesses. Uh, and with great effects, you know, certainly the first one we did was our forensics business. That business has grown 10% a year since we put that strategy in place. 100% cash conversion has been extremely successful. And that's great to hear because I know there are also particular challenges to working with consulting firms and, and external consultants coming in to work with those inside the business. What advice would you give or, or I suppose how have your organisation managed that process effectively? Um, you say within Ultra Forensic um, the growth that's been achieved um, since starting to work together and of course there's different aspects to that. But how have you achieved it? How have you managed to marry the internal organization with external consultants coming in? One of the things I like about the strategy and action process is it actually becomes one team extremely quickly. And whenever I go to a strategy and action report out or to review the end of the first week or the second week of work, it's interesting how much the strategy and action guys and the internal team have become one team and they are working together on defining what their mission, vision and actions are. 